today we're going to make a loop and off to the left here is where we're going to be coming out. Uh, today we're going to take the Lake Bloomington uh, interloop is what they call it. It's a uh, small route. I've lived in the area for uh, 25 years or so or more and uh, had only discovered this road just this spring when I got my scooter. So uh, I decided to take you guys on it and show you what it's about. Off to the left here we have uh, some houses or a housing subdivision that's around the lake and on the right we have cornfield. Lots of cornfields and soybean fields in Illinois. Once again I'm on my 2013 Kimco Super 8 150. It's a 150cc scooter and uh, I've owned it for five months now and I absolutely love this thing. Uh, if you get a chance check out my uh, other YouTube videos and uh, see what I got to offer. I've got some repair videos and uh, I posted a uh, review video on this scooter too. We got a guy up here walking his little girl, so we got to slow down for that. Um, here's where we start to get into the uh, meat of things. They take a left here, and then there's a little gate that they close off every night. And uh, there's a couple parks back here, but the road is really uh, maybe only one and a half cars wide. I don't. I've never. I've met cars on this road, but I've never uh, been in a car. And met a car on this road so I don't know how uh, tight it is to get through this but uh, it's a little twisty and it's tree lined completely throughout uh, the lake is on the right hand side and they've also got a couple of parks that you can access and then there's a trail side right there where you can actually pull over and walk a trail um, it's just a nice little place to uh, get a small ride and come and relax and uh, just enjoy the scenery and the shade. While riding uh, back in this area, you do have to keep an eye out for bikers and walkers and uh, the like because uh, there's a biker right now. Um, because uh, pedestrians use this as a walking trail too, even though uh, it's uh, wide enough for vehicles to travel down. Coming up on the right here is the first of two parks that are uh, on this road. Uh, people come back and uh, park their cars and uh, go to the lakeside and do some fishing and stuff like that. So uh, here comes the uh, second one here and you'll get a little bit of a view of the lake and uh, some of the houses that are on the lake. Coming up on the end of the road here, we're on the back side of that subdivision that uh, you saw earlier in the very beginning. Uh, we get a chance to meet a couple of cars here and uh, you can see how narrow the road is. I'm happy that I'm on my scooter at this point instead of trying to uh, 
get by uh, another car in a car or a truck. As always, you can leave a response and I'll get back to you. Uh, if it's a positive response, I'll most likely get back to you. If it's a negative response, eh, probably not going to get back to you. Don't forget, like and subscribe and go Tigers!